everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this one, we will discuss about how can you make one IoT-based smart plan model system using a DMV. So without any further ado, so let's get started. We are going to use here one Arduino. You know? this one and we're going to use one lcd display you can see here 16 cross 2 and also one module that's called the i2c module here and this one okay and you can see here we also use one buzzer here you can see here buzzer this one buzzer okay and also we are going to use one ir sensor and also one remote okay so this one remote okay you can brought it from your shop and also you can use one water pump here you can see this is called water pump and also one 9 volt battery and also one power bank and you can also use the laptop for the power okay you can see i am using the laptop and also you can see here we are using one soil moisture sensor okay this one okay and you can see above it is right now on okay and this is the full model of the soil moisture sensor okay and also for testing purposes we are going to use one a tree simple tree okay so now let's see how can we join that so first let's see how can you connect this lcd display one and you can see i am using one i2c module and you can see here there are nothing but four port so first port is nothing but call ground you can see this is the ground and the bcc and the sda and the scl so ground will go on the ground top okay and you can see this is the ground of the Arduino and this is also the ground of the Arduino it is selected on here and this is the ground okay so minus one is the ground and the positive one is the BCC connections and also you can see here the first one this is called the SCL and second one is the SDA you can see here SDA so it is actually connected on the port number A5 and the A4 okay so now let's see how can we connect the IR sensor one this is one simple IR sensor. So first one you can see this is the BCC connection that is positive and it will go on the 5 volt and the second one is the ground and it will go on the minus that's been ground and third one is the input channel. So it will actually go on the our Arduino board pin number 6 okay. This is one simple buzzer so you can see a long one that means long path is nothing but our output pin okay and it actually set on the our Arduino board port number 7 and the short one is nothing but the ground okay on the buzzer. Okay. okay so first one is nothing but called the pcc pin that's mean first one and second one is the ground pin and the third one is nothing but the input pin so you're going to set the input pin as the pin number three of the Arduino board so you can see here on the pin number three this is on the Arduino board this is for the relay connection and this one for the IR sensor and the third one is for the buzzer for the i2c connections you can see your first one is nothing but the ground pin and the second one is the bcc pin that's mean 5 volt and the third one is the sda pin it will go on the Arduino board pin number analog pin a4 and the last one is called the scl and it actually go on the pin number f5 on the Arduino board okay so without any further delay so let's get started and jump on the coding board so all right guys so right now you can see here this is the coding board and you can see this is called the final projects and uh, this is the code that I did before okay so let's see and discuss about that so first you can see here I import it here include hash include the IR remote dot is so this is the external library that you need to actually install this library so for that you need to go on the tools and you can see here uh, this is the board first you need to actually select the Arduino board okay and board right now is not uh, uh, visible because I am not connecting the Arduino board so first I am going to actually connect the Arduino board and you can hear one sound here okay and if you check that you can see here you can uh, see here one port that is com number 4 Arduino Geno or Eono board okay so I am using Arduino uh, 1.8.5 version so that's why on my I'm actually trying to install in the library I need to go on the sketch and include the library and you can see here manage library okay so I actually open this and just you know to type here the IR remote and it will automatically actually install this library on your system okay then you know to actually include here IR.h you can see your library management okay you know to actually search for the IR remote so IR remote okay 
so then it actually searching for that uh, make sure that you are connected to the internet because i'm not connected to the internet that's why it's not actually giving me like that you can also install this uh, uh library from the online as a github format and just you know to actually go on the sketch okay and include library and you can see add gif library here just press on here and you can actually using this here let's say go on the downloads i actually download this file so you can see here arduino ir remote master so I actually install this uh gif file from the internet don't worry i will put this code link and also this library link on the description just you need to press here the uh, open and it actually install this library on your system okay don't need to worry about that okay and you can see here you include the hash ir.s you need that and liquid crystal i2c why i2c because i am using the liquid crystal with i2c module so that's why and you can see record crystal uh i2c I, I and one variable let's call the lcd and 0x3f why 3f because my i2c scanner port is nothing but 0 cross 3f so i think in your case it should be 0 cross that's mean x 27 so there's a default to port it, you can actually get it from the shop this port but in my case the port is nothing but called uh you can see one code like kind of code zero x three f so in your case that should be maybe uh, zero x two seven okay then i initialize the uh variable for the moisture and the receipt pin this receipt pin is nothing but for my uh ir sensor and the buzzer pin and the i and one this is nothing but for the relay because we actually connecting the relay using the uh, uh relay and also the water pump okay and the two listed is nothing but for on and off status okay and integer soil is nothing but for the soil master sensor so now you can see on the setup you can see here lcd.beacon because you need to initialize the lcd and you also initialize one serial port here that's been serial monitor you can see this is the serial monitor call okay and you can see ir receiver.begin so ir receiver is nothing but actually receive the ir uh, ir ir you can say ir array from your remote okay so that's going to begin the with the receipt pin and also the enable the LED feedback. So make sure that you are installing the latest version of IR. So that's why code is uh, slightly different for the version number two. And IR receiver dot enable uh, IR pin. You need to actually enable the pin here. And you can see a pin mode buzzer is nothing but output. This is the simple uh, simple thing that you need to do while you actually doing the recording part. Okay. And you can see here on the void loop, you can see here you actually calculate the soil analog grid. Why analog grid? Because I am connecting the uh, soil pin in the uh, zero pin. So this is called the analog, analog pin. You can also use the digital pin here. Okay. And I'm going to actually uh, yeah, calculate the moisture. You can see your map equal to soil 0, uh, 1, 0, 2, 3, 100, 0. Why 1, 0, 2, 3? Because my highest value of the soil is nothing but the 1, 0, 2, 3. Okay. So let's see. Okay, I'm going to uncomment this line and I'm going to actually upload this code and see the that what will be the actual value that's been the maximum value for the soil. You can also see it on the serial monitor. Okay, just uh, open your serial monitor here and you, you can see here this right now 3 to 0 because this is on the uh, top. So that's why you can see your buzzer is uh, actually on and you can see here the value is nothing but 1000, uh, basically 23 when it is actually uh on the dry but right now it's on not dry so that's why the value is close to here okay so right now you can see the value is right now like that okay so that's why i put here the one two three because of the file is actually giving me the highest value as the one zero two three okay and hundred is nothing but for the making this as a percentage that's mean 20 percent or the 30 percent of the few to 40 percent like that okay so if the moisture is not is actually uh greater than 30 that's mean we are you're going to make this buzzer at loop that's mean there are a lot of uh water and the moisture is okay greater than 30. so that's why we are going to actually set the buzzer is low that's this time buzzer is off and when it will actually oppose it that's mean the buzzer is high okay then you're going to receive the code from the ir receiver and going to print it and you can see here one raw data okay so how can we actually get the raw data so on your remote i'm using the number bottom number one so that's why this is the raw data for that so if i actually uh, open my serial monitor and i'm going to pass here okay let's let's first comment this line okay then you can actually understand the thing comment this line and again upload the code so make sure that your Arduino board should be connected on your Arduino board okay so now let's see let's see on the serial monitor it is actually uploading here 
and how you actually press the one button from my IR uh, remote and you can see a one window that's called 31251494440. When you press the two and you can see a different but different different value three different value then four five six seven eight nine okay so the, you can see here some different value is actually generated here so you're going to focusing on the button number one so that's why i am going to actually uh, create one uh create one <clears throat> conditional loop that's it is the decoder raw data is nothing but this one so you can actually make this uh make this uh, what do you call the relay should be on so when the relay should be on so water pump should be on you can see i am using one state here to pull a state so high to state is zero that's mean it is high and again make this state at one that's mean on and off okay if you go here i think you understood this is the basic things for the programming part okay and you can see i received receiver dot resume so high in the ir actually receiving this uh ir value from the remote so it actually resume things okay and you can see actually uh, using the LCD set cursor because I am using 16 cross 2 LCD display. So for that I am going to set the cursor 00 and the 01 for that. So I am going to print here moisture as a percentage and the remote and the toggle state. So that's mean why the toggle state is 0 that's mean this is on mode and why the toggle state is 1 right now this is off mode. This is nothing but for the coding part. Okay. This is simple for the coding part if you are knowing the C or C++ or Python programming it's very actually very easy for you to understand the things. Okay. Because C is nothing but based on here. That's my Arduino code. It uh, you can see your hash include. It actually based on the C. Okay. So don't worry. I will put this code in the description. And you can actually grab the code from here and the GitHub. Okay. So there should be a password and password should be the IoT Smart Projects. Okay. So now let's test it out. That's our uh, code is actually working fine or not. So for that you need to actually click here to compile the code and just press here to upload the code. Simple. If you are actually getting any kind of error, so you can actually um, comment here or you can actually uh, knock me on my uh, messenger. That's been the Facebook page messenger or my or my Instagram or you can actually join my Discord server and message me directly here if you are getting any kind of error while you're installing the Arduino or any kind of error while you are actually doing these projects. Okay, so now let's see the testing part. So right now you can see the moisture is nothing but 63%. So I can actually plug and plug this soil moisture and put it in on the dry soil. You can see here right now moisture is right now 30%. And you can see buzzer is right now wall because this is less than 30%. So now I can actually press the button from the uh, remote and it will automatically on. You can see here off. Right now you can see here it is on. And now I am going to actually use here and you can see here right now it is off. Why? Because right now soil moisture is nothing but 72%. Okay. So now let's off the uh, button and you can see this button here. The uh, number one button. Again press on okay you can see it on right now and again press the button one yes right now it's on and also you can see this is a relay condition right now off on again yes on okay off it okay so right now it off so this is the all about the project The name of IoT based smart plant system and I can use the IR remote and remote the camera has input patabo then it will be based on the motor and you can see that the camera sensor is called the soil moisture sensor you can see here Airport I'm at LC display is course here and I try to see model because I'm a bit she put even actually oil is good to China should not say model is gonna okay Airport I'm like this course is simple tire sensor you can have a bit of them एक बार एक टा बाजार आच्छा करें जेटा एक टा आवाज कॉल बैठ की, ओके? अमी जो जेटा एक अन अनप्लाक कोरी फिर एक तुले फैली, एक अन टा आवाज कॉल बैठ कारण होते हैं एक अन माटी रात जो तक कॉमिक अच्छे, एंड एक अन किचु पानी देखा अच्छे, एक अन हल्का, एक अन देखा चार जो तक टी बिशी बार कारण एक अन पानी � अबर जगह होते हैं माटी राधा था बोला कि है ना ये माटी गुलाब चिकन भीजा माटी तो शेकेत्र की होते हैं मॉइस्चर एक बार देखा जाता है सेवेंटी परसेंट तले आर रिमोटेड आमदे बहुत तो मने टा ऑफ मोड़े आचे दर्शन ऑफ मोड़े आमरा जगह नेट का ऑन कर बो इटा ऑटोमेटिक ऑन हो जाए दर्शन आमदे की होते हैं आमदे 
एक अच्छा हम लोग यूज करते थे हम लोग एक टाइम रेडियो बोर्ड यूज करते थे एक अच्छा हम लोग तार पर हम लोग यूज करते थे रिले मॉडल बेसिकली हम लोग रिले मॉडल में माध्यम में हम लोग की कर बो हम लोग बेसिकली वाटर पांड के हैंडल कर बो हैं एक बार हम लोग यहाँ यूज कर लाम बेसिकली किस जंपर यूज कर लाम एक बार जो ब्रेड बोर्ड आर एक टा मानी टेस्टिंग जो नया मेटल ट्री यूज कर लाम बेसिकली बाजार के किन्हों से मतलब दोस्त टका दिए हैं आर एक हने देखा चाहिए टा टॉप सिंपल पानी अब पुन्ह एक हने एक्चुअली आगे एक हने बाले चिलो अमें हाल का पानी पड़ा करने रहो इसे पर वो तो हमने देखा हो कि वो हाँ चक्चली मने आद्रो दावा चो मारी मारी तो चोकन आद्रो तो कम तक बे आई मीन बालू चोकन हाँ चो शुक्ना तक बे तो कहाँ चो मॉइस्चर एक दम कम है चाहे ओके सो नाउ लेट्स सी मने आम्र की बाबी कनेक्ट गुलो कुर्स ही एक्चुअली हैं सो एक � एक नेट पॉजिटिव पांड देखा चाहे मने प्रथम टाइप चाहे बॉक्सली पॉजिटिव इटा चाहे बीसीस कनेक्शन मने फाइव बोल्ड दी तो बर्बा एयर पर एयर पर मास्क नेट टाइप चाहे नेगेटिव कनेक्शन इटा चाहे ग्राउंड बेसिकली ओके एयर पर टाइप चाहे इनपुट ओके आयन लिखले चल बे इनपुट आर ए इनपुट टा बेसिकली हमने आर्डर यूनिट दे छोए नंबर पीने ऐसे कनेक्ट कर सी ताम्र जो कोई कूटे जो बे बेसिकली तो कोई हमने बुद्धि बोला चाहे क्या ना हमने कहने छोए नंबर पीने की कर सी कारण हमने ऐसे बताऊँ हमने पावर सप्लाई ही शब्द क्या बोले हमने कहने तो ऐसे एक टा पावर बैंक यूज़ करते बारी आर बेसिकली आपने कंप्यूटर पावर सप्लाई यूज़ करते और तो एक में एक टा एडाप्टर यूज़ करते बारी हने इन एडाप्टर एक टा पूरा चे डी इन उते ओके अखंड देखा जाए कि बाबे बाजार टैक्टर से सेट करता है बाजार टैक्ट तो बेशी इम्पोर्टेन्ट ना एक्चुअली बाजार जेटा लंबा पिन आते हैं उटा होते हैं तुम्हारे इनपुट पिन बाउट पिन बोलते बारो ये वो जो नेगेटिव आते हैं जब मैं इन जर्च में होते हैं एक तो बैटरी टाइप है � and third one देखा जाता है जो है S D F pin ये तो basically हमारे Arduino board है analog pin है शोंजुक तो होगा ये तो F four pin है क्या तो है और ये पॉर्ट तो है जो है S C L जो है basically F five है हमारे connected होगा एक ना देखा जाए ये तो basically analog pin हमारे F five and F four okay तो ये तो है जो है basically हमारे connection टा एक बार देखा जाए कि वो एक्चुअल हमने कोडिंग टेक है ना अपलोड करते पड़े तो शेक तो हमने इसको बहुत चाहे हमने एक टा सिमर टा यूएसबी पोर्ट इसको टिप्स ही आराम रहा इसको टिप्स हमारे लैपटॉप जगह हमने कोडिंग पर टकोर बो एम एक हम तक हमने इजीली कोड टेक है ना ट्रांसफर कर दियो ओके Support me a lot and also provide me the really new breadboard, LCD display, I to C module, relay, nano battery, even water pump. So for the brothers that actually needed to making this out okay so he also a youtuber but he's new on youtube and you, he's actually makes some interesting projects and also upload the video on his channel so what's your channel name man my channel name is update planet oh your channel name is update planet so do subscribe the channels and also my okay 